Today guys, I'm going to be showing you how you can use ChatGPT on your phone. It's actually quite straightforward, so let's get started. Okay, so the first thing that we need to do is actually head over to the App Store to install ChatGPT because I actually don't have it installed on my phone just yet. So the first thing we want to do is head over to the search icon in the bottom right hand corner of our App Store and then we're going to go ahead and search for Chat. GPT and I always obviously make sure that I have capitals because of well that's just who I am I guess anyway here we can see that I have downloaded it for other devices so I do have ChatGPT on my iPad for example but I don't have it on my phone here so I have a little cloud icon this may appear different to you guys if it's not installed it might say something like get but this is indeed the one we want the official app by OpenAI this is what it looks like and um, yeah they've got an ad running at the top there but we want this one just here so we're going to click on the little cloud icon Icon. This is used because obviously I've already got it installed. Once it's installed on your phone, this icon will turn into an open icon uh, or button, I should say. And I'm going to go ahead and push that. That's going to open up a um, the ChatGPT by OpenAI onto your phone here. It's going to say, welcome to ChatGPT. And um, this is a free AI assistant that can help you with a wide variety of different tasks. Response uh, can be inaccurate, of course, because that's ChatGPT and you don't want to share any sensitive information. So we're going to click on continue and this is it. Now we have the free version of ChatGPT installed on our phone and we can go ahead and we can ask it something. Now we obviously hand write to it using text just down here at the bottom. Um, so, you know, we can say what is the day? Um, actually, I say what is the weather? Because, you know, I am British, right? And so therefore we're fascinated with weather. So what is the weather like today? and we can ask these questions and basically it will respond. And we also have a dictation, so we can basically actually just hit that and talk to our phone, which will basically allow us to ask it questions and it will respond accordingly. This is obviously the free version. It's obviously picked up that it's 39 degrees, partly sunny. I mean, I'm looking outside, it, it looks pretty sunny to me. And um, anyway, you can see it's a little bit hazy, partly cloudy, but yeah, that's basically the weather from ChatGPT there. Now, there are, of course, paid versions as well, such as signing up, you can get paid versions. I do have a couple of different paid versions, depending on your outputs, what you need ChatGPT for, but ultimately that is how you would use it on your phone. Download it from your app store. Basically, you'll have to, to have a free version right there and then that you can use, but you could also sign up, go through the sign up process and get a paid version as well, which will give you a lot more functionality. And guys, that is how you basically download, install and use ChatGPT on your mobile mobile device. If this works for you, make sure to smash that like button, subscribe for more hints and tips, and I'll catch you all in the next one.